So let me show you how to take scrolling screenshots on your iPhone 16 or iPhone 16 Pro. So you can actually take scrolling screenshots only if you're on a browser page, okay? No other page will allow you to take screenshots. Even if you go to a page like, let's say settings, this is actually a scrollable page, but this will not allow you to take scrolling screenshots. They only work on browser pages. So they work on Safari browser, the best, and then they also work on Chrome. I've tested a third party browser, which is Google Chrome, and it works, okay? So let's start with Safari. So in Safari browser, if you open a page that's usually scrollable and you take a normal screenshot like this, and you tap on the screenshot thumbnail, you'll actually see the option called full page. So if you tap on that, it allows you to capture the entire page in a screenshot and you have the normal options of sharing, deleting. You can even mark up, for instance, if you want to write something on the screenshot or circle something, you can do that. But then you have your entire full screenshot here of the entire page. Then you have the option to crop, and then tap on done when you want to save. That gives you two main options, which is save to photos, which means it's going to be saved in the photos app or in your photo gallery as an image, or you can save PDF to files. So that's another option. The screenshot could be saved like, like a PDF document in the files app. So you can choose whatever you want and that screenshot is gonna get saved. Now let's try Chrome. So in Chrome browser, we have an article here. Let's take a normal screenshot first with side and volume up. Let's do that again, side button, volume up, press once and release. And from the screenshot thumbnail, if you tap on it, you'll notice you also have the option for full page. Now, if you tap on that, you can actually see you still have your full page that you can share, delete, mark up, crop, do whatever. And then when you tap on done, also you get the options to save to photos and save to PDF, uh, or rather save PDF to files. So this time let's save PDF to files, tap on that, choose in the files app where you want to save your document. I'll just save it there. And that's going to be saved as a PDF in my files app. So now when I go to files and go to recent, you can actually see my PDF is right here. So that is basically how to save or how to take scrolling screenshots with your iPhone 16 or iPhone 16 Pro. Thank you for watching, leave your comments and questions down below and good luck.